Okay guys, my name is Lens and I want you to join the Lens Empire by subscribing to my YouTube channel and also smash the like button. I'm Lens. Okay guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to put Windows 10 on our flash drive some of you who subscribe to my channel and for those of you who comment ask and this is a video where I show you how you can put Windows 10 on your flash drive as you can see this flash drive is empty and you need to ensure that your flash drive is format you will need this tool this is one of the tools that I use for these sort of things there are also other tools available online that you can use this one is Rufus as you see there and this version is 2.17 and also you need to obtain a Windows 10 iOS file this one that I have here this one is five point something gigs and a 32 bit system and also the 64 bit system so I can choose which one I want to install depending upon my computer okay guys so I'm gonna go ahead and open up the software bear in mind that even though your flash drive have on stuff this would also format the flash drive so you will lose all your information yeah as you can see there are different system type and you need to know what is your system type for your computer if it's MBR partition scheme or BIOS or UEFI okay in this case I'm gonna choose MBR partition scheme for BIOS or UEFI okay guys so I'm gonna choose that and here is where you go and load in your iOS image file for this program you need to ensure that your Windows system whether it is XP whether it is Windows 7 whether it is Windows 8 or 10 you need so create a bootable this using iOS image we go here and we're gonna load in that same Windows 10 file here we load in this file here and then it says that it is ready right also ensure that your flash drive is loading up at the very top where it says device as you can see this flash drive that I have is a 8 gig and the system file is 5 gig point 48 I think so ensure that your flash drive is big enough to hold the system for whatever system you're desiring to install whether it's 7, 8 or Vista or 10 so I'm gonna go ahead and hit the start button it will ask you to format the device as I stated before so it will format it even though you don't format it and you will lose all your information and then we go ahead and press OK and then it will format and then it will create the system files and then it will copy the Windows files so this is how you go in about putting on Windows 10 on your flash drive you have to make Windows 10 bootable in order to boot from BIOS this is the quick way of doing it using this software there are other advanced methods by using command prompt and there are also a lot of other programs as well what I will do I will put the links in the video description for Windows 10 and also for Rufus so I hope that this video was helpful and if you would like to I would like you to smash the like button it 
keeps me motivated so i hope that this video was helpful This would definitely take some time so I would advise you just to wait it out and wait until all the files have been copied. In the meantime, while we are waiting for this to finish. I would just like to ask you one question yeah what computer would you like to have or would you choose of having out of a Windows computer or Mac computer which system or which brand do you think you would like to have as your main computer is it a Mac or is it a Windows computer I would just like you guys to comment down below let me know what is your thought on the different system and why you would choose a windows computer or why you would choose a mac computer okay so that's one question and i would just like you guys to comment down below and just give me your choice you know i just want to hear your feedback on which computer system you would choose would it be a windows system computer or would it be a mac and I want you to state why if it happens that you are a Windows fan where you like Windows then you, you just like love the Windows system or if it happens that you're a iPhone fan you love the iPhones and also you're into the MacBook and you love Apple products and you rather have a MacBook I, do, I would just like to hear the, the different opinions and i would like you to comment down below and let me know which computer brand you would choose yeah you can also make it a bit interactive also one of the thing i would like you to do comment down below if it happens that you're experiencing problem with this process yeah if it happens that you did this and for some reason the flash drive is not bootable you can comment down and let me know I'll help you on that or if it happens that you experience in any problem while doing this also I would help you out on that as you can see this would definitely take some time as it is 5 gig so in the meantime i would also appreciate if you can subscribe to my channel i do post a lot of different videos on different technologies uh, phones tablet computers solar panels and more so i would just like you to hit that subscribe button join the lens empire i do a lot of different reviews and also share a lot here on YouTube so I would just like you to subscribe to my channel so we can see that the copying process is now at 50% 51% and loading so what I will do not to bore you anymore 
so what I will do I will just pause this video and then resume it when it is finished okay guys so video resume and here you can see just estimating 94% unloading yeah so this is how you're going about easily putting any Windows operating system on a flash drive making it bootable yeah so this is how you're going about doing it this is how you're going about doing it yeah Normally, the Windows OS usually be around like 2 gig and some, depending upon which one of the system, like XP would be like under a gig. Uh, Windows Vista might be about a gig, and so forth. As you can see here now, we are complete. So now we can go ahead, close this, and we can boot our flash drive in F12 which I'm going to show you how to do now okay guys so you can see that the process is finished here so we're gonna close this and then let's check out the flash drive you can see the files are on the flash drive here both the 32 bit and also the 64 files I'm gonna go ahead now and eject this this so I'm gonna go now and eject this flash drive so now as you see I'm taking it out and I have my netbook here so I'm gonna just test it out on my netbook turn it on and I'm gonna hit F12 and well there's a security password on my computer so I'm gonna just enter that that's a BIOS password high tech stuff guys so I'm just gonna just enter that and now I'm gonna boot from the flash drive as you can see the flash drive is blinking there and the flash drive here is USB Sandis yeah so we're gonna just select that and we're gonna hit enter it's gonna say press any key to boot from USB you're gonna press the key and here you can see the two options 64 bit and also 32 so anyone we want to install we can install the desirable one we want to also for advanced option we can go to F8 and we can go to advanced option inside here so here is where i leave you with this video i hope that this video was helpful to you for those who wanted to know how to put windows 10 on a flash drive i would like you to subscribe to my channel join the lens empire and like this video thanks i hope this video was helpful yeah